Hello YouTube, today I'm going to be winding my Sessions Beehive Clock. I'm also going to be telling you the correct and proper way to wind your clock. So, your clock will either have one, two, three, or four keyholes. So usually one of them does the the movement. One does the hour strike, and if you have a third one, that would do the melody on each quarter hour. And some clocks, the top, have a small hole, usually at the 12 or in the center sometimes. It'll have an S, an F, right about there. I'll try and zoom in. There's an S right here on this one, and an F right here. Um, some clocks would be switched around. And if the clock was running slow, you would insert your key in here and turn it ever so slightly. Not like ever so slightly, but like, you know, little, about a quarter of a turn maximum. Then wait 24 hours and check the time. Uh, this could take a week to regulate the clock. Usually I'm, I don't really use that too much. Anyway, I'm going to get into winding, so you need the right key size, obviously. Make sure you hold the clock. That way it doesn't go sliding everywhere. And some clocks have an error right here to tell you which way to wind. But this one doesn't, and so you turn it the way you're supposed to crank if you turn it uh, a little slightly right here, it doesn't move. That's not the way you go. Try the other way, and it moves. That is the way you're supposed to wind. This is tricky to do because I'm doing it with my left hand. And once the clock spring cannot turn no more, stop. And um, some people think that when it's getting too tight, the string is going to burst or something. Or you could overwind the clock, but that won't really happen. Unless when it stops, you keep going, and something bad will probably happen. And don't drop your key either. And you put the key into the other hole, then you wind it again. And then you keep winding until this one's all the way at the top. Some clocks have a 31 day movement, 35 day, 7 day, I mean 8 day, and a 1 day movement. This one has a seven day, so it's going to take a little while longer to wind than a one day. Okay, that's as far as it'll go. After that, you set it to the correct time. So right now it's about 12.15ish.
then you close your lid and you're good to go. If you have any questions, uh, let me know in the comments. And uh, if you want to see more content like this, make sure you subscribe so you get notified when I upload. So I'll see you guys next time. Bye.